hell yeah I was gonna start recording so that's there we go that's gonna help me record by hitting that button okay so let's let's get up right here I am so excited cookable food rotten cookable food you can use like that thank you John uh, rotten cookable food you can use to uh, to increase your cooking skill it never even occurred to me not even close wait you're feeling sad as you stand in the rain that is spicy I like it Thirteen's pretty all right. The, the uh, like, four- or six-seater van is a little bit better than the two-seater. Oops, eh? There we are. There we go. Kill the engine. Getting tired. What's in the glove compartment? Guns, but no alcohol? What am I doing? Where's my booze? Darcy's going to get a little bit sad. The living conditions he's got to go through. Oh, maybe you should hold an M16. Like, how are you sad when you hold an M16? Yeah, like you just, you can't be. Oh man, we've got all the clothing to loot. Uh, this, these are the buttons we want, and let's get them. All right, and then on the floor we're gonna. Jam that into the inventory. He's not going to like this at all. Well, bowls are surprisingly heavy. Well, I should actually look at the screen. A zombie can sneak right up on you like that. I'm looking at my inventory. Okay, let's uh, sit down. Lace a bed. There we go. Great place to... No, please, please stop that. Anyway. No, no, stop that. Okay, anyway, sorry. Let's be fumbling around. What do we have for room? Quite a bit of room, actually. If I would take the time to read this book. Will smoking help sadness? It usually doesn't. We don't need to wear these right yet, but I would like to take them with me. That's a great stay-at-home item. We've got a, f yeah, we've got a fair bit of room. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start taking things. Just a couple of things. See, that's that's for the M16. That's gonna be that's gonna be all right. Yeah, you guys can come too. As usual, I'm not going to take any of the 223. It's for that's for the that's for long guns. Like long guns, like long range guns. They don't do a lot of damage. Yeah. Compared to like the 308. And the M14 using the 308 is is it's pretty 
it's pretty powerful and you can get a lot of range out of it so all right this is where we'll start tomorrow still a board board so so the okay so the um oh this is wonderful he has all of the weapons now Boop. It's still light out, so let's do a little quick a quick uh, ammo drop off. I'm gonna shut that behind me because with my luck Somebody will come through the darn window at me and I'm out front I could probably wear that poncho. Well, it might replace my jacket, which I do not want Flashlight Never used a oh, let's wait Where are you? I saw you. Just ever so briefly. There we are. Like a man in a scarf, you know. Nobody messes with a dude wearing a scarf. Because he's off to fly like a plane in World War One or something usually. So, you get out of that guy's way. Oh, guys, I'm so excited. This is the first time I have uh, ever gotten an M16. Where are... So... I definitely don't want to kill him off right away. That's that's for sure. We have a little bit less storage due to the um, running over of the zombie zombies there that I've been doing. Yeah, when I almost got killed doing my inventory shuffle into this van last time, well, not last time, but the time before last. Almost done, guys. I was scratching my elbow after I had just said out loud and recorded, this is the embarrassing part of it. Uh, you know, you got to keep your hand on the keyboard for this one. And then I did not do what I just said that you should really do. Ah, oh, man. If you were wondering if I was a human, that should make me pass the human test. Definitely not a bot. Don't ever put your finger in the socket like this and then they get electrocuted. And, and it's like, do, do, do I laugh at you? Is that acceptable or... Not only because it was hilarious, but it's something exactly I would do. Tell somebody not to do something because it's dangerous, and then do it. I'll take a laser. A laser. Yeah, I did the uh, Dr. Evil air quotes there. You bet. You bet I did. Oh, we're taking it all. And then he's probably going to want to have a drink and go to bed. Can't believe you didn't bring any alcohol. What were you thinking, man? Not him. It's not his fault. He does had nothing.
nothing to do with his inventory selection. So we got crackers, vitamins, and yet a sea of food. I uh, like a two minute. I, it was in the building I started in. I didn't have any food. Like I'm, 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 I'm actually kind of like I'm staring at my inventory. Like what? Really? Yeah, I should have uh, should have been ready there because even though there was shotgun action outside and everything else that could should have alerted a zombie in here. Uh, the game kind of likes to surprise you once in a while. So I should be doing this before I open a door. I want to talk about a jump scare. When I whip that door open and shoot a zombie in the face, he very was jump scared. So let's fill these. We're going to throw one into the one and one into the other. And then I'm going to look in the proper inventory. We're going to take the one he's not drinking from and dump it into his backpack. And we're going to smoke this loose cigarette in his regular inventory. And he's going to do some of that. Oh, yeah. Let's eat these crackers. Eat them all. They're not. They, yeah, they might solve Peckish. No, they did not solve Peckish. Still is. Could, could use a bite to eat. Anyway. All right. He's going to pose down like that. That's fine. Go ahead and do that. Kind of scary. Oh, crap. My alarm. It's... I should just shut it off entirely. It's for, uh, you know... Boop. Love to see it. Power is still on, guys. So I've got time to... Oh, inventory. Where are you at? There you are. Uh, how tight are we on that? Okay. All right, let's take those. And then we're going to hit Beat Street. Back out to the van. I hope you... I hope you guys have all tuned in to watch a guy walk back and forth through a van with lots of stuff and in a thunderstorm that seems to be never ending. Oh, I should have so started a garden before I left. Now he's starving. That's some loud thunder. But one of my favorite... Uh, uh, the long dark bits is the sound. What what makes the long dark for me really good is the sound. And they have nailed it. Project Zomboid has definitely nailed natural environmental sounds. Like because the rain sounds. Differently when you're next to a. Uh, a vehicle versus under an awning. I really thought this out. On more angles than I'll probably ever be capable of. Running out of room for ammo. That is so wonderful. I'll take the goofy axe. And then we'll fill up that little car and tow it. Nope, stop going in there. Okay, so. 
plastic bag. Not what I'm looking for. Wait. I ah, see. I like the uh, that revolver. It is. It's. It is. Ooh, another M. Oh, like we're taking it. It is good. I think they were almost ready for this, you know? Probably just needed a moment to catch their breath. I think we should saw the, the shotgun, do some so shotgun sawing. Like Llewellyn in uh, A Country for Old Men. Oh man, I left the door open. That was a terrible move. I find thunderstorms actually kind of mess with zombies though. Is that a thing? Because I find that they're like, they just kind of st yep, stumble around like that. Okay, so, that won't fit in the trunk at all, so we have to go to the driver's side and then drop everything we can in the seat. I've always kind of wondered, like, you know... Why certain, like, the Magnum rounds go at that speed, but the 45s, they go at that speed. Like, I get the shotgun shells, but Magnum rounds and 45 auto rounds, it's... Box would be... Roughly the same size, not like a big fat shotgun box, shotgun shell box. Those are, those are fairly large. Did we? Are we done there? Thinking yes. Yes, we are done there. Hmm? Sorry. Hiking bag and uh, military desert camo t-shirt. Military t-shirt. Definitely uh, take that. Uh, military bulletproof vest. It's so great if you if you rip your pants you just put on new pants I love this uh, this the surplus store just because of it like I can even I'm getting even leave pants and just like just remember that you know there are pants here Got three magazines. That one has nothing in it, so so we'll leave it. Yeah, man. Military boots, gas mask. Holy cow! This one's just this is like the junk drawer. Got many shotguns. It's the M16s mostly in the M14 that I'm kind of really interested in taking. What does that fit on? 
Eh, nothing I'm interested in. Okay. Ooh, this one's roughed up. This one is not. He is very heavy and very unhappy about it. It's like, would you stop telling me to pick up stuff? All right, hop in there, buddy. See, not losing, not losing too much. Oh, I didn't realize we were there. I didn't mean to do that. Well, I mean, I did, but not that. Okay, so uh, still way, way overweight. Anyway, we'll solve that. Oh. Yep, shut your car off, jerk. All right. Okay, here we go. Trucking on over. How much trunk space does this thing have? 32. Oh my goodness. That is a lot of space. Throw a couple of assault rifles, and other rifles, semi-auto rifles, you know, in the, in the car. Thing, it's a family vehicle, so we get actually, this is, you get more trunk space out of this car than you do, or at least storage space out of this car than you do this van. When the van is in the condition that I have made it into, I'm not dissing my van. I love it very much, but it's not healthy anymore, which is my fault, but it's not healthy anymore. All right, we're getting down there. Wait, you never know when I want to stop and read, so can't, can't, can't ditch that. Yeah, so uh, it's going to be quiet around here for a little bit, but as soon as we go to the gas station, it's going to get very shooty. I mean, noisy. Splish splash. Okay, actually. Ugh. Oh, and I wanted to ask, because uh, so John was telling me about Nimble, and I do have Gymnast. I do have the Gymnast trait, so the Nimble will go up quicker, faster. Light-footed. What is that for, though? Because sneaking is sneaking. Understand? Candy package. Darn right. Sneaking is sneaking. But, yeah, what is light-footed? It's all here. Rock candy. 
weekend, Chile. Hear that helicopter? Sweaty, uncomfortable. Hey, guys. You took, you took, you picked a weird day to go for a tour. Look out, guys, it's a helicopter event. Here, here, here they come. There's usually... The last time I did this fight in this area, there was a lot more zombies than these zombies I've killed and this guy. You know? Ugh, I need to practice with my hitting stick anyway, so... Anyone. Okay, here he is. Oh. Cowboy hat and all. Walking around in my surplus store. I don't know if I like that. Ooh, a lighter. Take it. Thank you. Hey, it's another zombie. You think it's going to come back? Oh, another zombie. Two zombies. Yes, definitely got to get the music going for this. Oh, I'm counting five. Hey, you. Come on, helicopter. Help me out here. Yes. I bet I help out the helicopter in bringing zombies to me with the uh, their friend the shotgun. Yes, hello everyone. I bet you there's a generator in there that we're gonna get. No, I'm kidding. I'm not gonna do that to you. We'll wait till there's a bigger group. There we go. Oh! Did I? I did not reload after I opened that box that I didn't open. Ah. I got distracted. Alright. Okay, let's try this again, guys. Sorry, everyone kind of group together, please. 
Yep, that is the spirit. There we go. All right. And then we'll group you guys up again. Where are you going? I hear the shotgun blast just slightly off to your left. All right, well, some of these zombies got the hard of hearing trait. Come on, guys. That guy got the heart of pain attention trait. Come on, man. Pay attention, guys. Ooh, he's got an iron rodent. Or anyway, it's one of the biker gang guys. He might have a gun on him. I don't know why I care. But yeah, there's a lot more down here at the gas station. And I'm guessing, like, a little bit further this way, there's, uh... Yeah, like, we might be able to kill everyone off and then seriously trade up for some, some nicer vehicles. Alright, guys, come on. This is my first shotgun rodeo during the during the helicopter event. I've done this a couple of times. Mostly not because I wanted to. You generally don't ever want to be outside. God, they're loud. Don't ever want to be outside during the helicopter event. And then you shouldn't be really shooting off a shotgun during a helicopter event, because then you ended up with again. crowds like this. Which. Like, I'm working on the man's aiming. So. Whoa, whoa, let's not go that direction. Yeah, let's. Group you guys back together. Yep. There we go. Did try to turn it down. Like, that is a loud gun. I did turn down the uh, desktop audio a little bit to kind of you know, save you guys some of that shotgun blast sounds. But yeah, we'll get a generator. It's the how to use generators. That's the important bit for me. I would like to use generators. Wow, you guys are everywhere. This is great. Ah, that car is going to mess with them. Yeah. Have some scissors sticking out of your back, sir. I cannot be comfortable. Like I can't stand it when I have like a brutal night's sleep and I crane my neck. I couldn't imagine scissors sticking out from between your shoulder blades. Undead or not, I can't be comfortable. Oh yeah, the pincer. Uh, it's a good move. Like strategically, it's how you win wars. Wow. 
Wow. There are a lot of you guys. And now there's like three less. One AP point, that is nice. Well, I definitely have to check out how we're doing in our skills after we've done this uh, helicopter event. Yeah, we did so well that they sent a helicopter to congratulate us. Yeah, that's, that's, you know, I'm going with that. This wasn't an attempt to get me swarmed and murdered. This was a celebration. Are celebrating. Come and join the celebration, everyone. I love how they're still just on mass showing up. It's great. I think the helicopter event is over. Uh oh. I'm sorry, bud. Let's, um... Uh, let's get you. A smoke. Read most of these guys, I'll never even search. Let's have yourself some chips. Getting kind of tired, but as long as we don't push them too hard, it won't be too bad. All right, guys, we're going to take the circle back up. Yes, indeed. All right. Oh, man, did that not ever go well? Huh. Oh, yeah, we'll chamber around and we'll reload. All right, now we'll shoot at them. Bring these guys together. Because you'd be surprised, I do, I will end up going through most of this ammo. The way I play. Is that? I haven't set anybody on fire. Mostly because I seriously risk setting myself on fire. Wow, they are just... There are many, and they keep coming. Wow. This is beautiful. Oh, 
Wow. The volume of zombies streaming from over there is just, it actually forces me to go this way. That's crazy. You guys are... You guys are many. And I am but one man with a shotgun. That will eventually actually break if I keep shooting at these zombies like this. That's the thing, though. I eventually can just bleed them away and How would you rate your dining experience today? Like, I swear, that guy, he's already in that crowd. Everyone, come this way, please. That's his ticket. Like, like, I'm not sure what would cause this guy to do this. Everyone else is vibing. Well, not everyone. A lot of people. So is, is he going to the previous shotgun sounds, you know? Is that what they're stuck on? Okay. All right. Wow. That... That is a lot. As a matter of fact, I get a little, little bit framey when I actually look at the crowd. It's kind of spooky. I think we mostly got the crowd going where we wanted to. Mostly. Whoa, you're not what I'm looking for. Okay, well... <laughs> Let's, uh, again, a lot, and there we go. No, no, no. Thank you. That tree was completely invisible to me, or else I wouldn't have walked into it. Look at another cluster just they just keep coming. It's great. It was like they didn't quite know where I was, even though the helicopter brought them to the area. But then the shotgun blast, you know, really really helped, you know, direct them. Just not keeping up with me.
Might as well open it while we're kind of ahead of the pack here. All right, perfect. Yeah, we'll get him to agree. Group up. Oh, yeah. Yep, did not give him time to... You know, chamber around there, so. Look at that. They busted open. Ah, there's no generator in there. You guys, though, thank you. That was... I was going to say, that was, like, fairly charitable of them to open that door for me. Yep, that, please don't bite me. Look at them all, just, just mushed into that doorway. All right. Might I suggest you shoot the zombie closest to you, sir? Yeah, we're gonna have to actually probably make a run for my truck. Ditch these guys. Or pick up more ammo. And eat the coffee. Says he's hungry. He's not going to like this at all. Come on, some peanuts. Uh, maybe we'll have, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll open the candy package. Oh, now the poor guy's thirsty. As you would be after eating like just a bunch of raw coffee. Hey, okay. we get everybody back up here again for another get together. Yeah, see, I knew I only broke off a small group. down to here. One more box of shotgun shells. And there are still way too many of them to work over with a 9mm. Tell you that. crowd is getting smaller. I've got a feeling most of these zombies are just kind of leftovers. They got stuck on things or whatever. And the main group is still kind of clustered, you know, kind of stuck up in there. Like, I'm not really getting anywhere. It's, it's getting smaller, but the group is so large, I believe, 
Thanks to the helicopter. And I may have to completely retreat here. Okay, we got to get Got to get luring them away from my car. I think we're there, guys. Hammer, empty bowl, can opener. Can you drink any of it? We have a pop on us. like a mint candy would that be helpful it's not hydrating but soothing you know wow there are still many many zomboids okay guys I gotta race you back to my truck sorry Oh, there will be no racing you guys back to my truck. You're already there. That's it. We are out of ammo. I think I got like one or two in here. Right? Yeah, we do. All right. Okay, hopefully. Really, really hopefully. I cannot miss and make it to the truck in time. There we go. Get in. There we go. when you're just eating chili and hanging out there's a lot of these guys they just kept coming because I have been under like you know in a situation where the uh, the helicopter is within range of me but I have Oh, look, a gas station, guys. This is convenient and populated. Popular place. So I thought all these guys had already come over. Like another survivor. Well, not successful. Or trinkets. Or trinkets. What do you think? Do you think I can get away with some nine millimeter work here? Don't freeze on me, game. I wouldn't appreciate that. Well, because I would just want to get the poor guy a drink of water. These clowns are just grouping around. Grouping around. Oh, I think I know where we can go.
Here's the zombies, right? Turn the lights, get out of the car, run into the surplus store. They'll be coming. Yes, fill. Empty bottles. All. And off we go. Hi, guys. Oops. Nope. That was too much confidence. All right. We've had our drink. Let's have a smoke and uh, back to work. All right, guys? Let's do this. Let's clear the town. Paint the town red. The blood of our enemies. Okay, well, maybe, you know, I got a little too excited there. What the... Come on, really? It's this dark? Oof. Not the most cat like eyes for cat size. Like, I can't see crap. Alright, let's get back into uh, the light. This is horrible. But I think if we tighten them all up, we can get them, you know, to kind of. Stay in the lit areas. Whoa, man, this is ridiculous. This field of view is is not good for somebody who's not exhausted. Yep. Nope. Can you do it? Nope, not like that. Okay, ah, uh, this is distressing because I cannot see a thing. And yet, they're very well aware of me. Oh boy. Hey guys. At least they opened this back door for me. Oh. Really? It's this poorly lit at midnight? Come on. Where are your street lights, kids? Hmm? All right. Okay. All right. Settle down, everyone. Getting hungry. All right. That's it, everyone. Come down here in an area that is not near my ride. Because, yeah, I've, I've, on second thought, now that I pretty much can't see, uh, maybe I shouldn't be doing this blind. You know, I'm not very good at it when I can see, so.
Okay, this one's going a little long. That's why I want to get back to my truck. Not only because I can't do this, but... Uh, but, you know... It's it's been it's been an hour. We're good, you know. We've all seen you know me run around shooting at stuff for a while now. I mean, I doubt you're getting bored, but at the same time, it's time to wrap this bad boy up. Oh, where did you come from? The side mostly. I imagine this path would be nice and dangerous. My god, if you were a community member, you'd never go for a night, night walk. You'd hit a pothole and take your teeth out. Like, this is ridiculous. So dark. This is what you get with, uh... Ooh, these guys are all nicely spread out, too. Oh yeah, I should be looking for how to use generators as I blindly run by. Can't see. It's like, don't go on the grass. That's what that camouflage does, you see. Huh. So I think you know what? Let's uh, let's let's, let's slow down this radius of blasting noises. If we're going to shoot somebody, we'll do it with the nine. Ugh. Because from here, we have to go to a city that's got a bookstore. And blast a bunch of zombies. I know, you're like, is that your, is that the, your only thing? It's a like, yes. It's my only thing. It's the only thing I do. Is blast them. Ah, uh, sometimes I stab them, I guess, but. They just. Hilarious. They just group up like this. As long as we're not winded, I'm okay with being tired. Did this work? Okay. Okay, come on. How many of you were in that building? A lot of zombies. A lot of zombies. Can I race these guys to my car? Nope, guess not. Oh! Really? Give me my vehicle, please. Come on. I said please. That's very nice. Let's put on some headlight. I knew I only had one. All right. Well, I'm going to pull up here. We're going to stop. And uh, I'm going to say thanks a lot for watching. We'll uh, continue this mess at a later date. All right. Everyone, keep surviving.